So I've got a few of these young ladies popping up in my uh, in my area now. Is it Bastila or Bastilla? I've got no idea. I didn't watch the Kotor. But um, there she is with a Zeta, four star, and a full Jedi team. Ezra, and of course a Kenobi with a Barris, which is what I use. Um, and there's my team, uh, my arena team. Now the whole basis of my arena team is basically um, to dodge and steal. Uh, so as we can see here, Grandmaster Yoda is going to steal the buffs and pass them on. Now, the thing about, I'm going to say Bastila. I've got no idea, but I'm going to say Bastila. The thing about Bastila is that she is, you know, similar to uh, Jedi Rey in that she um, she buffs the team very well. So we've got a character like Yoda who's able to just steal those buffs and pass them on to, let's say, uh, a, a Gear 12 Wampa. Uh, it's not going to make for much of a fight. Now, I've made a mistake a couple of times in this fight in that I used old Ben to try and debuff. Uh, because my, my potency on, on old Ben is quite high and that's how I normally take care of uh, of the Sith teams is I'll just block them out straight away and I can get through them quite easily. Uh, but watch how this watch how this fight progresses. Watch how many how many buffs. <laughs> it's like buff after buff after buff because obviously there's two I mean look at that. <laughs> that's ridiculous. It's like two Christmas trees. Um But this is this is really how I beat her just by by mirroring mirroring what she offers her team stealing it uh, and then throwing it straight back at her <laughs> like it's ridiculous you can't even see Barris in the background <laughs> you can't I mean it really is ridiculous seriously you can't see I mean, if you look at Barris in the background there I don't know how much health she's got how much protection she's got I really have I really have no idea what's going on so you know Ezra's gone um, targeted him first because he was a rebel. Wampa's got um, extra hits against a rebel. But none of my none of my team have gone down um, just yet. That's ridiculous. Look at it. That's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. There has to be another way. Capital Games, there has to be another way to to do this. I can't see Barris's head. <laughs> How am I supposed to know if I'm gonna target her or not? So I didn't I didn't bother. I just had to get rid of Yoda so that it all tidies itself out. You know, again without Ezra, this this opposing Jedi team hasn't got any any kick. You know. Um again that was a mistake. It was a mistake, mistake to try and do that. Um, but without Ezra, there's no there's no kick to that team. There's no you know Yoda's there, but he's not you know he's not particularly strong. Look at him. Um, it's just kind of dodgy. And there he's gone. And now they've got nothing left. So I found in this game um, one of the easiest ways to beat you know a popular team or a meta team is simply to mirror that team you know if all of a sudden it's empire then you just need a better empire team if it's all of a sudden jedi you just need a better jedi team you know um there are some instances where individual characters can make a difference you know so for example a team with you know yodas and wampers and night sisters and things like this are going to be different that's not necessarily a synergy team um in the traditional sense but really you know if i want to beat bastilla here i'm simply going to go against her with jedis and a wampa um, I don't, I'm not going to rely on debuffs. I mean, that, you know, I mean, look, there we go. So I'll shut up for the rest of this fight. You can enjoy it. But if you want to beat Bastila, uh, beat her at her own game. <laughs>